Hi everyone. Today's question is: Is it okay if I eat non-veg only once a week? And definitely, eating non-veg only once a week is better than eating non-veg every day. You know, when I moved to Oroville from Mumbai, Oroville was still closer to a village, and people used to eat non-veg only on Sundays. And that's because they don't have fridges. Sunday is the time when everybody's together. So even the butcher shops, the roadside butcher shops, used to open on Sundays, and their health used to be much better. And nobody was overweight. But things are changing really fast. Today, people eat non-veg every day. So if you can't stop non-veg altogether, it's better to eat it only on one day. And you know how you feel when you eat non-veg? Doesn't it make you feel tired? That's why people had it only on Sundays because it's so difficult to digest that you have a big meal of non-vegetarian food and go back to sleep, and then you wake up in the evening and perhaps you don't even need to have dinner, right? So Sunday is a day of rest, and that's the day people eat non-veg. Now, if we eat non-veg during the day, what do we feel? Tired. If you eat non-veg at night, what do you get? Acidity. So this is because it's not food that's suitable for our species. Ideally, it would be best never to eat any animal products because they are not meant for our body. But if you do eat them, minimize them. And if you're not eating them at all, it would be wise not to ever make exceptions. Because these things are addictive, just like a cigarette. Like you know that if someone stops smoking, you tell them, "Don't have just one cigarette." Even if they are with friends, socializing, and if they one cigarette comes, they're likely to fall back into the trap. And it's the same with non-veg. If you have it once in a while, you're likely to make more exceptions. But if you clear the way. And say no non-veg at all. Over a period of time, you'll never feel like having it again. And if you do feel like having it, have it, have it, and see how your body feels, and see whether you really enjoy the taste. I know so many people who don't feel like having it anymore after stopping it. The only reason we have been having it all this time is because of conditioning, because everyone else is having it. But once you stop, you never feel like having it again. It's a kind of mindset as well, right? Today my mind is on non-veg. If I shift it to vegetarian, I don't feel like eating non-veg anymore. And if I shift it to vegan, I don't feel like eating, consuming even dairy. I saw a fabulous movie which you can find on YouTube and Netflix called Game Changers. And it's about people who really care about fitness and how much protein they eat. Nobody needs non-veg for the protein. Where do the cows and buffaloes and elephants and horses get it from? We don't need it, right? But if you really crave it, nowadays there are so many alternatives so that you can have things that taste like meat but are not really meat. And the best part of them is that they're really not addictive as well. So try. It.